been able to come parallel and get our way back forward when we do set up. You could say All things have come full ground, circle for Chad Pennington. 11 years ago, he was about to attend the NFL Combine. Now he's preparing players for that same Combine that can make or break their draft position. And what has to happen as a player is you have to understand that it is important. Does it make you a better football player? No but it does show some skills that maybe some scouts and organizations are looking for. If you can show those skills, it may put more money in your pocket. That's just what guys like LSU quarterback Jordan Jefferson and running backs Torin Poole from Tennessee and Brandon Bolden from Ole Miss are hoping for at this pre-combine training camp in South Florida. What you think about that before you even come out to train, you know that a tenth of a second, basically taking money out your pocket is how we put it, because I mean, that's what everybody's running for. Very carefully planned, systematic, scientific approach to make sure we can get the best results at the right time for these guys, because it's very much about peak performance. But it's not all about technique that will make these players run their fastest 40 or perform the best in the shuttle run. You see, there's a lot that goes on behind the scenes as well here at the pre-combine training camp. It's about their nutrition. And yes, they even do yoga. And most of the guys are saying yoga is the hardest day of the week. <laughs> and it's supposed to be on a regeneration day. So, you know, the flexibility is absolutely essential not just to improve their 40 time, but to protect them from injury down the road. And with enough success, maybe one day they can come back and train the next generation of football players. In South Florida, I'm Jason Alpert for CSS.